What's up guys, everything Apple Pro here, and here are 20 things you didn't know about the iPhone 6S. Now, I don't guarantee you don't know every single one. However, most of these were a surprise to me. Now, an analyst reports that the iPhone 6S parts value is just $234 in comparison to a $650 base price. Now, between 16 and 64 gigabyte, there's a 12 to $20 difference in storage, and Apple's charging us $100. Now, with the 6S, Apple is on track to break records. That's 1 million more on pre order weekend than the iPhone 5S, which itself was an earth shattering record. The most popular version of the iPhone 6S was the 6S Plus in rose gold 64 gigabyte. Prices on eBay are above retail by $200 to $500 right now, and they're actually selling. The iPhone 6S has a cleaner exterior, no more FCC labels, as new ruling allows that you to remove FCC labels from the actual device as long as they're easy to reach in the settings. The new iPhone will also no longer have the IMEI imprinted onto the rear casing. Instead, you'll find that on the SIM card tray or inside the software settings. Two gigabytes of RAM has been confirmed. Everybody can exhale. We've been wishing and waiting so long, but it's finally here, confirmed by an Xcode leak. It has been confirmed that the new Taptic engine shipping with the 6S will completely replace your vibration motor. You know that awesome new keyboard trackpad that Apple introduced with iOS 9? Well, they removed it in the Beta 3 and they're making it exclusive for the 6S. So you'll be able to activate it with a 3D touch and no longer can you do it on any iPhone besides the 6S. You'll be able to use 3D Touch to instantly pop into the app switcher, which will make multitasking so much easier and quicker on the new 6S. I cannot wait to try it out. Now we know the 6S is heavier and thicker, but why? Well, because of the 3D Touch display. That new technology must make a sacrifice, and the new 6S as a result is 14 grams heavier than the iPhone 6. The 6S Plus is even heavier than that. The iPhone 6S Plus, not only does it exclusively have optical image stabilization, Apple added video image stabilization as well. So now you'll be able to see that function extended into video recording. You'll no longer notice that shake and video will be so much more stable. And that's even better paired with the 4K. Now the individual pixels on the camera are actually smaller, which may worry some when it comes to nighttime recording, but Apple actually developed some new technologies such as deep trench isolation, which should make nighttime recording no problem and on par or even better than the iPhone 6 camera. Now, due to the greater megapixel size, Apple upped the focus pixels as well. The new 6S features double the focus pixels as the iPhone 6, making focus sharper and faster. Unknown to many, but Apple silently updated the slow motion capability of the iPhone 6S. You can now record 1080p at 120 frames per second. What a great update. Now, Live Photos brings photos to life. It allows you to capture a few seconds before and after the picture to make photos more lively. However, the great thing is it only takes up two times the memory as a standard photo. Now this is something very important to consider if you're an AT&T customer. Do not buy an unlocked phone. Buy strictly an AT&T iPhone 6S as they do have a unique LTE 30 band which is much faster and improves coverage for all AT&T users. Now in the official iPhone 6S video ad you can see the Touch ID being used. It is crazy fast. Where we have a couple second delay between putting our finger on the sensor and getting through to the home screen, Touch ID on the new 6S is instant and it's amazing to see in action. It's officially been confirmed based on a leaked video advertisement from Apple that the iPhone 6S battery will be a downgrade from the 6. Battery life will remain the same, it's just the capacity went down to 1715 mAh from 1810. Now exclusive to the 6S is the always on Hey Siri function, whereas on all other iPhones, you have to have your phone plugged in and charging in order for this to work. You know how the iPhone 6 has some ugly and dull packaging? Well, the new iPhone 6S packaging has a lot of color in it. It looks beautiful, especially the darker color on the iPhone 6S, it looks great. And there's some new wallpapers that might be included with the new 6S. Did you guys know that the A9 chip in the iPhone 6S was actually built by Samsung and it's using a new 14 nanometer construction? And lastly, the iPhone 6S will have a much more scratch resistant display. Whereas the iPhone 6 was so prone to scratching, the 6S will do much better not only in that department, but also shock. And there you go. Sorry, it was a little bit over 20, but with this video, I just wanted to bring you guys some things you may have not known about the iPhone 6S. Most of these were a surprise to me. And as time goes on, we're going to be learning more and more about the iPhone 6S. Guys, I just, I can't even explain how excited I am for the iPhone 6S. There's a reason this thing is going to be all sales records. I mean, this thing is a great piece of technology and it further advances the iPhone lineup. Who knows what the iPhone 7 could even bring, but this thing is plenty and all I need right now. Anyways, guys, thanks for watching this video. Be sure to check out some other videos on my channel. Subscribe if you haven't already. Have a great day while you wait patiently for the iPhone 6S. Peace.